So welcome everyone to episode 87 of the Portsmouth Career Mode. I mean, I might be slightly out there with my numbers, but um, I mean, I did fail GCSE maths for a reason. But uh, yeah, we've got another episode here of the, um, I just said it, Portsmouth Career Mode. I've I, got, I failed English as well with grammar. Um, we've also got <laughs> Burnley. We're going to simulate that one um, because, um, I mean, we have Spurs in the Europa League. I, I hate playing English teams in Europe, but it is what it is. We'll play Spurs. We've got City in the Cup, which really throws it out. I don't know how we're going to work this because Bournemouth are just above us. We need to play that too. Oh, God. Thank you, FIFA. Burnley. Come on, lads. I don't think we want to get you up, do we? I'll tell you what we need right now. We've just lost to Burnley at home. Not great. We've got Spurs. A team is not beaten this season. We know how to solve this. I'm not weird. Okay, right. So, um, we've got a really tough game against Spurs. And we've, um... We've got our two best midfielders out. Okay, only 10 days, that's fine. Dislocated shoulder, get well soon, Adley. Hashtag get well soon, Adley in the comments, okay? <laughs> Come on, big, big game, lads. Big, big game. We've got Spurs away. We could beat this lot, apart from the fact that they beat us last season here and they beat us 3 2 this season. But we're just going to gloss over that. You know, we can beat this lot. We can beat this lot, you know? So um, we've got a makeshift midfield of Ben Close, who's going to. Be a traitor and leave us without me being able to do anything. And we probably are going to do exactly the same with Garcia. I'm not at all salty or annoyed about that. Let's just move on. Shackleton as well. So that's not going to help us. Spurs. Yeah, they're, they're going to beat us, aren't they? To be fair, they have Marcus Rojo as a centre-back. So, you know, we've got every chance. But I'm going to take these glasses off now. Because I need full vision for this game. Go on. It's in. It's Shackleton. Oh, side so net him. No. Okay, the Spurs are getting close. That's not really what we're going to be seeing, lads. Brilliant ball. Brilliant ball. Now to Curtis. To Curtis. Go on, Curtis. Go on, Curtis. Curtis. Oh, he nearly went to try and go alone. No match gets there. And that's kind of undeserved. Because Spurs, I'd say, have been the better team. But I'm not going to argue against this. Up until this point, been quite, you know, bad, really. You know, not, not great. That's... Yeah, it's, it's not been not been the best game, but we fired some life into it there, luckily. And Metcha is on fire at the moment. Great, let's just keep it, keep this going. We need energy. Nice one, come on. How is that still a skit? Seriously, I don't know how it's still going. Felix, yes. Power, go on. Okay, maybe off the basis of that, it's not really a bad thing we're getting rid of you, but still, I didn't want to lose Ben Close. He's, the, he's going to sporting of all teams. Nothing wrong with sporting, but like a bit of a random move, really, isn't it? Half time. It is 1 0 to Pompey. Away at Spurs. Decent, to be fair. We've been good. We still could do with another goal, just to be on the safe side, though. Shackleton. Shackleton. Okay. I mean, he's got one goal for us so far. Sessignon. No. 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 Bergwin loves a goal against me. That's like the fourth goal he's got against me now. He's becoming like the Werner of this career mode. If you watched a previous series of mine, you'll know why. But a good goal from Bergwin, to be fair. It's been evenly matched. And I'm pleased that we're actually getting a challenge in the Europa League for once. Because so far, really, other than Slavia Prague, it's been a bit of a, quite easy. Let's be honest. I know it's only one all, but I'm not going to go out to another English team, okay? A team we're used to playing. A team that we've beaten twice in this career mode, okay? It can't happen. We've got to beat this lot of the two legs. Come on. Who's that? Bergwin pretends to take it. Gambian. Not actually that bad, to be fair. Go on. It's Shackleton. It's Shackleton. It is Jamie Shackleton. It nearly was. Isn't Okay. That's scrambled away. Who's that? Son. Son, he swings it in. One of the few actual players in the team, and he goes and scores! I, 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 I think I know who that bloke is, but I don't really care, to be honest. 2-1, we've got on it. Yeah, we're playing the second leg now, aren't we? Bournemouth, I really wanted to play because they're ninth, but I mean, I don't know whether I will. Can I be bothered to play it off camera or not? I don't know, but they go and take the lead. More importantly, we're not going out to another English site. 
Okay, uh, we're not going to go out to another English side because we've beaten Spurs twice in this career mode in season one. Okay, so we can do it, lads. Come on. Sorry, no, not season one. We were in League One, David. No, it's the season in the Premier League, more like. Come on, come on. Now we need goals. He took his time, but it was worth it because Phoenix the Metro has another goal. 2 2. Um, I mean, this is a fair resort away, to be honest. Felix the Metro, yet again, is just on it. He just knows where the back of the net is. Great goal. Come on, let's keep this going. All right then, Smith Rowe going to go off for Harnes. Also, Conley off uh, on for Power. It was uh, quite a quiet game, to be honest, against his old side. And Van der Berg for Garcia. Who's that? I don't know who that is. is Numbele, giving his shirt number. Song goes for goal. Ben Close cleared that. But you know what? I am really happy with that. 2-2, Two -two, away from home, tough plays. A team got quite a mixed record against. And we didn't have Adley or Harper. Particularly Adley, two of our best players. I'm very happy with that. So, straight into the next game. City in the FA Cup. We're going to have to play the second game against Spurs, obviously. Bournemouth, no idea what's happening in that one. But City, third time this season, unfortunately, we're playing this lot. And, um, well, the, the mayor beaten us here in the league and we drew away somehow when we absolutely bossed. Uh, we see Everton, Spurs have got United and Liverpool obviously. Wow. <laughs> Liverpool beat Palace 4-0. I'm literally recording this as Liverpool just beating Palace 4-0 in the Premier League. So that's spooky that is. Even though it is the cup and it is City, I want to rest players for that Spurs game. Seddon, Van der Berg, Harper's now back but still not Adley. Shackleton to be fair to him did well in the uh, first leg. Conley and Harnes all start and we've also got Naylor on, and on the bench and Richardson and Marquise also could maybe, maybe make a rare appearance. We've seen their team loads of times now. It's just insane. Well, come on, lads. I want to go all out in the FA Cup and Europa League. And you know what? This is actually going to be the first episode in quite some time where I'm not going to play a league game. It's just Europa League and FA Cup. Probably my two main priorities now, because the Premier League's gone. We're not going to get Europe that way. You know, I'd be amazed if we do, because we're just too inconsistent. Even sim games aren't, aren't on our side. Martinez, that would have been a terrible start. FA Cup, and particularly Europa League, only weighs into Europe. We're in. It is Connolly. And we take the lead. This bloke, he doesn't start many games, but when he does, he just bangs them in. What a bloke he is. Aaron Connolly, I'm telling you this, if you want a little backup striker in FIFA, sign him, because he's a quality lad. I don't know why I'm saying that, because I don't know who he is. I've, I've never met him before, but yeah. 1-0 we lead against City. Are we actually going to beat this lot at home? Because we've not done that once yet. Sane, Odegaard. Um, right, okay. Right, that... that. That was an absolute mess from start to finish. Deckleton. Jamie. I, how? I'm playing a weakened team and we're, we're breezing past this lot. To be fair to Shackleton, this is a, another start he's got. And he's actually having a blinder again. He did really well in the last game. He played He scored against Wolves. And that's a good goal. Again, 2-0 against City, though. It's the match. I'm going to go for it. Oh, and he nearly scored. He nearly scored against his old side again. Upper, Go on. Are we just on a mad one today? I don't know what's going on. We're beating... <laughs> we, we may... We, we just might be beating City 3-0 after half an hour. Um, here comes comments saying I've rigged it, it's on beginner level. You know I don't play on difficult, an easy difficulty. If it was a breeze, I would be top of the Premier League, wouldn't I? I wouldn't, okay, maybe not that, but I, I wouldn't be struggling, would I? So, proof that I haven't rigged it. This is just pure luck. Remember, it's FIFA 20, the scripting. Silver. Silver, though. Okay, I mean, there's 11 chances, but they're just, just not taking them. First. Don't you know. It, it can't be four. It can't be four. Curtis, I dithered. No, I'm out. I... I... <laughs> no. No, no, no. Watch the second half be goalless now, because that happens all the time. You just go turning one off, 
This is actually, this is mental. City haven't rotated one bit. We've made like five changes. We haven't even got power or Adley and we're beating this lot 4-0. And yet they battered us at their place and in the first game. Corner them. <laughs> Curts it. <laughs> it can't be, man. Shackleton, I'm going to go for it. If that got in. It's half time and... We might be falling up against Man City. Um, EA just being nice to me for once. I mean, can they get a goal back? Good ball. They actually... Okay. What? Okay. When even Aguero is missing an absolute sitter. What is going on? Shackleton. It's going to be five. Um... I mean, I knew apple juice is powerful, but, like, apple juice really is that strong. So, Marquise is making a very rare appearance for the Mecha, not Connolly, because the Mecha's literally dead. He's got no stamina. So, I'm going to play, technically play Marquise as a cam roll, which is a bit of a, you know, weird one, but with five and up, so does it really matter? No. Plus, also, a rare chance for Naylor and a youngster in Richardson. So, we're getting some reserves in here. What the hell have I just witnessed? We have just convincingly beaten Man City. We didn't even get luck. City were absolutely shocking. They really were. We were brilliant. But still, FIFA scripting had to play a part in that. But let's not focus too much on that. Nemecha, I even forgot who scored the goals. Nemecha, Curtis, Shackleton, Connolly. What a way to prepare for a massive game with Spurs, though. So the semi-finalists of the FA Cup this year are Liverpool, Everton against Brentford. That's an interesting one. But Everton won that, Portsmouth and United. So we've got a big game. I would favour Everton though, because they're probably the easiest team. But we could be a, we could be getting another FA Cup final, and we we win it in the Championship. We we need to be winning it here, really. I'm honestly sick of playing this team, man. We have United again in the FA Cup semi-finals. This time at Wembley. So another Wembley appearance. The first time in ages we've been there. What a way though to end off what has been really quite a very good episode. That made no sense, but Spurs. At home, could this be our final game in the Europa League this season? No, it isn't. It is not going to be because we're going to win this. 2-2, we have the advantage as it stands on away goals. But we want to get this done. We've got to get this done. Now, of course, we're back to full strength. Only I've taken Shackleton out and put Close in simply because Close has got better stamina. Plus, I do prefer Close, to be honest. And with Warwick still got him, we might as well play him. We know their team, full strength, seemingly the same as last time. But what a way this could be to end the episode off. A place in the Europa League quarterfinals, where we got to last season. Of course, this year, I want to go even further. Can we take down Spurs? Come on. But really not the greatest start at all. Sessegnon's in. Sessegnon, do not. The most disastrous start we could have possibly hoped for. Okay. I don't even know how to describe that. That This could not have gone any worse. First shot, first goal, Sessegnon. Wow. Come on, immediate. Ben Close. Ben Close, come on. Why well, we still got Ben Close? I want him to be appreciated. The unsung hero of this career mode, who's going to be leaving us to go to Sporting at the end of the season, could maybe have scored an absolutely huge goal there. But what a start. Like, okay, what a start. And maybe also, according to this at quarter to 11 at night, means I can't really go too mental if we do turn this around or even if we do lose. So, yeah, apologies in, ad in advance, okay? No, no, no. If he just dinked me there, I wouldn't have no words. But, okay, I think as it stands, it will be extra time. No, just no. Clear your lines, I'm not risking anything. I think it would go to extra time as it stands, which I'd rather not have. Come on, boys. It's Harper. It's Harper. It's Harper. Oh, damn it. No pen. No pen. I was going to stop talking there. That, I think that was a penalty for me. Curtis. Come on. 
It's Troy! Come on, Troy Parrot! Oh, Troy Parrot against his old side. You love to see it. You really do. You really do. You get off to the most disastrous start you could possibly have hoped for. A terrible goal. And we immediately go and concede. Are we on here? Are we on for another Man City v Spurs a few years ago? Literally last year. Where it's an absolute thriller in the Champions League. We're, we're on for it right now. Troy Power rested in the last game completely. Fully fit now. And he comes back and scores a quality goal. Setting on. Do not. He has been a constant threat. Ryan puts it wide. Tell you what. You wouldn't even have seen most of these. But, yeah, you wouldn't even have seen most of their chances. They have had, like, eight shots in this first half. But all of them were just so weak. Like, blazed over the bar. Just not even worth showing. Like, since we scored, we have not... We've hardly had a touch of the ball. We're 2-1 up. 4-3 up on aggregate. A disastrous start, but we turned it around. What a tie, though. This is going to be remembered. What a tie this is. Let's just keep this going, lads. Come on. Clark. No, no, no. No, no. Clear your lines. No. Henderson, mate. You are an absolute legend. What a save. Okay, he's not going to show you again, but what a save. Corner, though. Sessegnon. Spurs are really not giving up. They've had an absolute ton of chances. We've hardly had any. Genuinely. Apart from our two goals. We don't even deserve to really believe in this. I mean, I don't know. Offside. Please tell me it is. No, it isn't. Great. You know what? I can't even be too annoyed about that. Like I've just been saying, they have been bombarding us. Completely and utterly bombarding us with shots. Left, right and centre. No exaggeration. It's not. I'm not even surprised. I really am not. But... This is big now because I think, as it stands, we've both got two away goals. I think it's extra time. Smith throw. I really shouldn't be playing this late at night because, like, I want to go mental if we go and win this. I've got to try and be a little bit quieter, to be honest. Come on. Come on. Appa. Swing it in. Come on. Come on. We're getting closer. Power. Come on. Come on. No match to keep the ball. It's got to be Troy. Bow down, bow down to our magical number nine that we stole from this lot, that we stole from Spurs. Spurs, we've had some thrillers with them in this career mode already. This tie will be remembered. No, no. This is so nerve-wracking. This is so nerve-wracking. I don't know what happens if they get a goal. Like, I've, I, I'm not very good with away goals sometimes when, it, when it's in this situation it's really quite difficult to judge sometimes smith throw smith throw come on let's go and kill this one off we are unbelievably lucky man oh my god spurs have been i know i keep saying it but i just can't go over this spurs have been absolutely just well on top well on top this is why i don't want to lose Ben Close, because he just does moments like that. I don't care that he isn't playing every game. Yes, okay, technically he's one of the weaker players. He's one of the OG players. Doesn't matter. He still scores bangers. He still scores crucial goals. There's a reason why I'm annoyed that I don't want to lose him. And there's nothing I can do about it. Ten minutes left. We've now got breathing space. We'll just, just hold on. Come on. No. Bergwin. They're still going to try and make it interesting, aren't they, Spurs? They're not giving in. They're not giving in. That's exactly what I keep doing. That is the story of the game. I win the ball back. I pass straight to them. That bloke nearly scored. Oh, yeah, by the way, three changes to skip it. Power going off for Connolly and also Seddon for Williams. The match is also completely dead with his stamina, but I've got to keep him on in a time like this. I honestly, I've played some thrilling games of FIFA in my time, but... That is one of the best I think I've played. One of the best European ties. Just a mental game. What a, what a game that was. 4-2, 6-4 on aggregate through to the quarters. So then, Severe beat Milan. 
I wouldn't mind facing Zavir. Okay, that's winnable. Lazio. We could get redemption on them. You know, we knocked them out last year, David. Okay, but we could play Lazio again. Lil beat Villarreal. We also got Ajax. I don't really want to play Ajax again. I don't, because that's a bit boring. I've played them already. Schalke. I would not plan it. I wouldn't mind uh, playing them. I've, I've got actually got a Schalke career mode off camera that I've not played for a while. But their stadium is just insane. I love their stadium. Atalanta beat Roma in an all-Italian tie. And also Frankfurt. I wouldn't really want to play them again because we had them in the group. Right, so we are 11th in the league. To be honest, Premier League, I'm, I've lost interest. Because we've had such a bang average season. There's no way we are getting European football. Just look at that gap. We're not going to close that gap. We've been so inconsistent all season. This is why I don't care whether it's realistic or not. Winning the Europa League, Champions League football, or even winning the FA Cup, at least we have minimum the Europa League again. Because, you know, we're not going to get it. I just realised I'm playing a slightly weaker side. But we do win one now. What more getting sent off, though? Curtis with the goal. But one final game then, Bournemouth away from home in the Premier League. Obviously, there's not really anything to play for now in the league, but I got I can't just simulate the rest of the games, can I? Plus the fact Bournemouth are literally just above us by like two points, and they're technically a rival, bit of a dead game. There was a penalty for us here though, and I went bottom corner, like, pe like people tell me to, but somehow I didn't score. When here, literally just two days ago, I scored a penalty with Everton, Timo Werner. I know it's a top, top striker, one of the best in the game in my opinion, but still... Exactly the same thing, didn't score, really annoying. We did score here though from a corner and we actually scored a header. Van der Berg who came in, I think for Garcia, slightly rotated. We did go one up, a really good header. Adley had like three shots in a row there, which is mental. Another good chance here, not quite enough. Adley made it two and that was about it. And of course Adley was back in this game because he's been injured for the first three, the ones I've played in this one live. But yeah, that's it for this game. 2 no win against Bournemouth. Schalke. I will take that without a doubt. I'm really looking forward to that. I'm really looking forward to that. Schalke, we could have had a much harder team. Spurs again. Oh, and then Schalke. Um, I don't know how this is going to work, man. I, I, okay. Oh, they, they, no, this episode is just absolutely ram-packed. But yeah, ram-packed episode to come on Wednesday. No videos uh, the next two days, unfortunately. But just look forward to this episode. And lots more to come in the very near future. But until next time, lads, please do like and subscribe to Rads. Let's get to 700. Follow me on Twitter, at Rads underscore 23. And I'll see you very soon, boys.